I know you guys don't care about taxes and some of you guys don't even know what taxes are. And some of you are not American, so you also don't deal with the same tax system I deal with. However, I was sent a 1099 from Twitch for last year. I was also sent a 1099 from PayPal last year. And my Twitch got deposited into my PayPal. So, some of you might be putting together the pieces already. Dun, 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 dun. I got charged twice and they want me to pay double the taxes on all my Twitch income, which is bullshit. It's not how it should be. And so I was talking with the tax person that they use, who is very knowledgeable, and they were like, yeah, no, this is wrong. You shouldn't have been given a 1099 for Twitch if they're paying you through PayPal. So we're gonna have to do it the hard way. So it's just very confusing and basically taxes are, they are stealing from me, they are stealing from us. I think we should, no, I'm not gonna say we should evade them because I feel like I might get I get, might get thrown in jail. Even though I pay my taxes, I pay my taxes, but it's ridiculous. And so that's my, that's my rant about friggin' taxes. Taxation is theft. They say taxation without representation is theft, but it's true, they're not being represented. And not being, things are not being spent the way they should be spent. Why am I spending so much money? Where is, where, where are, where is my free healthcare? Where is my healthcare? I don't have healthcare. I have no healthcare right now. Fun fact. It's not so, not so fun of a fact. Not, not cool. I, I want some healthcare. I want, I want something. Give me nicer roads. Give me some infrastructure. Infrastructure. I tell you, the the roads near me are so bad. There's, there's holes in the roads. It's bumpy. I'm bumping down the road, and not in a good way. Not in a cool way where you're like bumping to music. It's like you're literally bumping because there's holes in the road. Fix my road. They don't fix our roads. They. Uh, don't do anything for me. And also the schools are shit. Well, it depends on where you live. The fancy schools and the fancy districts are fancy because the fancy people with the fancy houses pay a lot of fancy money. But then where I went to school, that was not how it was. A lot of issues. A lot of issues. <laughs> La 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 la. Come to the UK, give free healthcare here. I don't want to go to the UK though because I'll get stabbed on a train. And I'm afraid of that. I'm afraid of that. But also if I stay here, I'm going to get shot. So there's really no good. There's nothing good. <laughs> there's no good alternative. Come to Canada then. Then I can have maple syrup. You know what? Maybe Canada is a good choice. Maybe Canada is a good choice. It's a rarity, more of a scare story. It scared me though. It scared me. I'll have to have a bodyguard. Big, strong bodyguard. Protect me. Keep me safe. Come to Australia and get eaten by animals. I don't know a lot about Australia and their... There are large animals that eat you. What? Is that really a thing? I feel like when I think about Australia, I think about kangaroos. I remember when I was a kid and they brought in, I don't know how it is in other, other schools in the US and then other schools outside of the US, but we had multiple times where they brought snakes to school when I was a kid and they showed us the snakes and they showed us like how to tell if a snake is poisonous or not. And like a lot of it had to do with like looking at the patterns and looking at the shape of the mouth. Is it like a V shape or is it more of a U shape? But I was always like, girl, I don't want to get close enough to a snake to find out. I don't want to get close enough. I feel like my eyes are not that good. Like I have really poor eyesight. I would have to get very close to the snake to be able to tell if it's poisonous or not. <laughs> They're like, okay, look for the fangs. Do the fangs have this shape or are they, are they this shape? Does the mouth curve this way? I'm like, looking, 
let's see if this one's poisonous or not so that I can decide what to do. I'm like, bro, yeah, who is going in for an inspection? I am not going in for an inspection. I will stay back. I will stay back. I will just treat them all like they are poisonous and run away. <clears throat> Unless it was attacking me. And then, and then it's the end of the snake's life. I don't care. You have no excuse to get that close to me. I also wanted, when I woke up this morning, uh, our door was cracked and I feel like it was dark and so the door was cracked and I saw it and it looked like it was opening but it was really just like an optical illusion or something, I don't know. And I wanted to get up really bad and close the door and like go do like a perimeter check and lock the door but I didn't do it. I didn't do it, I was like, it's kind of funny how I reason on myself. <laughs> and this might not sound comforting to other people I don't know, I, tell my, I told myself, I was like, you're okay, everything's fine, no one is here. And I was like, and if they are here, I'm dead anyways, so. But then I was also telling myself, but they're probably not because why would they be staying and just sitting in the living room instead of just coming and getting me, you know what I mean? Like, you would, if someone broke in, they would break in and they would immediately come and take you away or like, stab you. But since, uh, since it didn't happen immediately, I was like, it's probably not going to happen. So it's okay, you can fall back asleep. <laughs> and that is how I reason on myself. And you know, my therapist told me it's actually a good, it's actually good to reason with yourself. Even if that's how you do it. If I can reason on myself and not make myself get out of bed in the middle of the night to go with a knife around my home and look with a flashlight, um... If I can find a way to not do that, no, it's, it's a good thing. <laughs> it's a good thing. Wow. Emma Watson did an amazing job. She did a great job. That movie gets me so hard. Like, oh my god. That, that sounded wrong. 